So the beat is happening, right? I think so. I'm feeling it. So it's like coming up on lunchtime. So I decide to close up Cubase, go to the kitchen, get some quick lunch, come back a half hour later, open up uh, Analog Lab for some more tweaking, some more noodling, so forth and so on. And this happened. Yeah, for those of you guys who are in the cheap seats and can't really make it out, let me explain it to you. I opened up the instance of the Analog Lab plugin and the UI is completely gone. That's right, ghosted. Which means it basically renders the entire project unusable. I can't work with it. If I can't tweak the sound, then my only options are to um, go with it as it is, which is a non-starter when you're working in a professional environment, or to, after <laughs> a lot of time spent cussing, crying, so forth and so on, get up off the floor and then spend an, maybe an hour or so going through a list of new plugins and then uh, that aren't Arturia and trying to come up with a sound that's going to match the sound that I had with the Arturia plugin but can't use because I can't tweak it. And for anyone who's out there wondering, yeah, I did do an enormous amount of troubleshooting. I closed up and restarted uh, Analog Lab many times. I tried to bring in a new instance of the plugin. Didn't work. I tried closing and restarting Cubase many times. Didn't work. I even uh, stopped and then restarted my computer a couple times. Nothing doing. Nothing changed. And as if it can't get worse, Arturia knows about this issue. I actually went to their forum uh, and typed in a description of my problem and up came a post that was pretty much exactly, I can't even put pretty much, it was exactly addressing the issue that I'm having. That post, if anyone is wondering, started in August of 21. I was the last person to post to it but two days ago, and that was after, um, I believe it was the original post, or you'll see it on the screen, on the screen, <laughs> but maybe he was screaming, um, had come back to, uh, to give yet more information, and his post actually occurred a mere five days before my post occurred, which says that this issue is ongoing, it is contemporary, it is prevalent, and as I said at the end of my post, this is major. Arturia, I'm a believer. I'm a believer in your sounds. I'm a believer in a lot of things you do, but you guys need to fix this, okay? And just to prove my point that I'm a believer, not a hater, I'm now going to go through a few presets just to show you the glory, the beauty of so many of these sounds. I'll do a few leads and then a few pads just so you can see, hey, um, this stuff is really has a lot of merit to it. Now, don't get confused by uh, Analog Lab intro being on the screen. This is actually the standalone version. On my second screen, I have Cubase that's open and that's, I'm, that's what I'm going to be playing to. This is not um, my rejuvenated uh, analog intro, uh, the analog lab intro plug that's just come up out of the dead and and shown its UI. It's still DOA, dead on arrival. We go.
So, now we come to the part of the program where we get the final answer. Is Analog Lab intro ready for prime time? Can you use it in a plug-in instance uh, with a DAW? Well, at least as far as my answer goes, I think you know where I'm going with this. It is with heavy heart that I have to tell you no. I can't at this juncture. Um, the risks are just too uh, great. Even with the beauty of the sounds being what they are, I, I just can't. I can't justify using Analog Lab Intro in um, certainly not in a professional situation where I know the chances are better than great that I'm going to have to eventually excise that plug-in and substitute it for another you know and taking an hour or two out of what would have been a clean work day in the process to do that so Arturia you have a believer here in your products in a lot of way I love your sounds I love your attitude um, but um, there's some things that you need to work on under the hood get that taken care of and uh, a lot of Arturia lovers out there are going to be a lot happier with the product. Okay, that's what I, that's the way I see it. Hope you guys are well. See you soon.